Hello guys, it's AD Forest Pro here and in today's video you will learn about the two forms of trading, fundamental analysis and technical analysis. By the end of this video you will have a better understanding of how these two forms of trading work. Whether you are a long time subscriber or you are a new viewer, I want to thank you for your support and for joining me on this journey. So let's get started and explore the concept of fundamental analysis and technical analysis. Make sure to watch until the end because there's a special bonus waiting for you. Don't miss out on this opportunity and remember to subscribe to stay updated on all my future content. Let's begin without further delay. There are basically two forms of trading that traders use to analyze the market. Fundamental analysis and technical analysis. Please take note of this as we will talk about them. Let's start with the first one. Fundamental analysis is a way of looking at the forex market by analyzing the economic, social and political forces that may affect a currency pair. The rationale behind this type of analysis is that if a country's current or future economic outlook is good, its currency should strengthen. This method of trading is also known as news trading. You analyze the market with respect to the news. Every day, various news are being released by major countries. You see all these news on forexfactory.com, dailyfx.com, CNN, Bloomberg, CNBC, etc. Now, remember, fundamental analysts hold on to the fact that it is news that moves the market. Your MT4 app also have a summary of news section. Here's what you need to know. If the economy of a country is improving, the currency gains strength. Opposite is bad economy results in lower currency value. Let's dwell on this point a little. We use the US dollar as an example. If the US economy gets better, raising the interest rates may be needed to control growth and inflation. It is a known fact that higher interest rates make dollar-dominated financial assets more attractive. In order for traders and investors to get their hands on these assets, they have to buy the dollar first. This increases the demand of the currency. As a result, the value of the US dollar will likely increase against other currency with lesser demand. Recall that we are talking about how news affect the value of a currency. The good thing about the FS market is that you can make money both ways. If a currency pair is appreciating, we go long on the pair. Buy. If a currency pair is depreciating, we go short on the pair. Sell. Those of you into crypto trading, in the early days, when you buy a coin, you only profit if the value of the coin increases, although some crypto exchanges are now improving. Like many traders do, we buy some and sell some. So in forex, you make money on both sides of the news. After discussing about technical analysis, we'll come back to discuss a very important news. In fact, the most important news in forex trading, the king of all news, which is the NFP. Now, the other form of analysis is technical analysis. This is the study of historical price movements in order to determine the current trading conditions and potential price movement. The rationale behind this form of trading is that all current market information is reflected in the price. Technical analysts analyze the market using indicators such as relative strength index, moving average, Bollinger Bands, MACD, fractals, etc. Technical analysts also use chart patterns candlesticks, support and resistance, pivot points, Elliott waves, etc. When you use any of the above to analyze the market, it is called technical analysis. This is the most popular form of trading. As a trader, you need to learn how to trade the market using this method. Reason is that high volatile news are not released every day. Later, we are going to learn how to use these indicators. Now, this is what you need to understand. Both forms of analysis is useful. No one is superior to the other. No one is used in isolation. So we are going to learn as we move on how to harmonize the two. Since we are done with both forms of analysis in forest trading, let's go back to discuss the king of all news. So yeah, this is the bonus I promised you guys. So let's get right in. NFP stands for non farm payroll. This is a news released by the United States of America. Among all the news released by the US, this is the highest because it's 
causes the most volatility in the market. NFP is one of the biggest news that every trader waits on. Let's understand what the news entails. It's a news that contains various data and statistics released by the US Bureau of Labor and Statistics. It is very influential as an indicator of US economy because of the US Federal Reserve makes monetary policies decision based on this data. Hence, investors, financial analysts, forest traders, stock traders makes trading decisions with the news. It is released every first Friday of the month by 9.30 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. That's 2.30 p.m. Nigeria time. Just calculate according to your time zone. Later, we'll learn how to trade it. Or better still, if you want me to make a video on how to trade NFP news, leave a comment in the comment section of this video. So for now, just know that it is very important. It's major. No forest trader faces an event on the first Friday of any month except it's a night event so as a forest trader never miss it if you are driving and it's 2 15 pm gmt just park trade the nfp and continue where you are going that's how big it is most traders trade once in a month they fund their live account especially for nfp and close for the month most people make what should be paid in a year just on an nfp afternoon that's how massive nfp news is it causes large volatility in the forex market so yeah guys that's it for this video if you enjoy it don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to my youtube channel for more contents like this one thank you for watching and yeah peace out love you guys love you guys